so in today's lecture we have learned about the production of x-rays for example there is the there is the anode plate which have a high atomic mass and these are the cathode rays with the high voltage the voltage is 10,000 when it will strike here and the production of the rays coming out will be the x-rays how let's see this is the shell the nucleus electrons are there okay which have a high masses okay so these cathode rays are coming from outside means electrons are coming and and going to the outer shell which is k shell it will be the inserted in this with this have a high potential electron will be inserted in this and this will be moving from k shell into the l shell it will be moving upper side and the downward of the electron will be coming back the radiation comes from the upward electron from like it will be coming downward so the radiation or the production of x-rays will be counted if the electron is moving upper side and this one high potential electron is moving downward side so the x-rays will be produced by these electrons when electrons strike with k shell and will be moving upward and the down and come and then upward electron will be coming downward so the production of x-rays will be done so this is the uh, production of x-rays we have learned today that how x-rays produce so this was the lecture we have done in chemistry class